Are you ready for today's story? <laughs> Let's go! My bedtime stories. <laughs> Read with me as we make the world more magical one story at a time. Earth Day Every Day by Lisa Bullard, illustrated by Xiao Sin. Chapter 1 What a Mess! My name's Trina. I'm an Earthling. I live here on planet Earth. So do trees and bees and manatees. Unless you're from Mars, you're an Earthling too! People don't always take good care of our Earth home. We do things that hurt the Earth. We make the air dirty. We throw away too much. We waste power. Mom says people should clean up their own messes. Earthlings made this earth mess, so we earthlings should fix it. It's a job for everyone. Chapter 2 Miss Big Mouth My brother calls me Miss Big Mouth, so I used my big mouth to help the earth. Last week, I asked everyone I know to plan something for Earth Day. Today was finally the big day! Earth Day happens once a year on April 22. On that day, people everywhere remember to help the Earth. Earth Day also reminds us to take care of Earth all year long. My teacher taught my class how to plant trees. Everyone got to help! Someday, our trees will grow to be much taller than we are. They'll make good homes for birds. You can also plant special gardens to feed bees and butterflies. And trees and plants aren't just helpful to animals. They also clean the air we all breathe. My friends formed an Earth Day Club. We had a first meeting at lunch. Earth's problems mean problems for animals too. Even my favorite tigers are having trouble. So our club decided to save money to help animals. People have formed many groups to help animals in trouble. The groups find ways to protect animals and the places they live. They study the animals to figure out new ways to help them. You can learn more about these groups on the internet. Ask your teacher or a parent to help you look. Chapter 3 My Family's Earth Day My family and neighbors had an Earth Day trade. Everybody brought stuff they don't need anymore. It's better for the Earth when we reuse old things. Reuse means to use something again. Then it doesn't end up in the trash. You also don't need to buy new things. Trading and reusing helps the Earth. We traded for things we want. Mom wouldn't let me trade my brother, so I traded an old puzzle for a soccer ball. Now my family is having a special Earth Night. We turned off the TV and the computer. That way, we don't use as much power. Instead, we're playing board games. My dog, Daisy, and I are winning. Using power can make the air dirty. So turn off lights and machines whenever you can. Play outside instead of playing video games. Saving power helps save the earth. Maybe you can use your big mouth too? Together we can talk to everyone about helping the earth. We'll ask people to make it Earth Day every day. Then we can all find other ways to save the earth tomorrow.
Thank you so much for staying and reading with me until the end. Please give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed this and share it with your friends so we can all read along together. See you on our next one. Bye!